The Delta II rocket will be launched for the last time at Vandenberg Air Force Base on Saturday. It's the end of an era and the start of a new one. KSBY News reporter Melissa Newman spoke with students and staff from Cal Poly's Aerospace Department and has more on the CubeSat that will be sent on the final Delta II rocket launch. This is Dave, or the damping and vibrations experiment that's about to make its big debut in outer space. Students and staff at Cal Poly have been working on this special cube satellite for over 10 years. It hasn't been tested in space before, and if it hasn't been tested in space, nobody wants to include the technology on a large spacecraft because it's higher risk. Right? And so what we're doing with Dave is we're going to test the dampening technology out on a lower risk spacecraft, a one-year cube set. And with the data we get back from that particular test, we'll hopefully be able to justify you know, further exploration of this particular dampening technology or adoption in larger spacecraft. Dave will be attached to the final launch of the Delta II rocket flying out of Vandenberg Air Force Base on Saturday. Once in space, the team at Cal Poly will be able to learn more about particle dampers, which could potentially reduce equipment bouncing around while in orbit. Similar to the brakes on your car, right? They dampen your car, they slow you down, right? In space, you have the same thing. There's energy in the system. It's not driving down the road, but there's still energy, and there's certain times you have to take them out, uh, and the dampener does just that. Students who have worked on this project say they're excited to finally see the Dave CubeSat sent into outer space. I spent almost an entire summer of just nonstop work uh, two years ago on this, and finally seeing it go will just be really amazing. In San Luis Obispo, Melissa Newman, KSBY News.